M Installer makes it quick and easy to install your templates, plugins, and compositing elements. M Installer is a free download from Motion VFX. To begin, first click the free download button from the website. Once downloaded, double click the Installer DMG. Installation is as simple as dragging the Installer app into the application shortcut. To open M Installer from the Launchpad, click the Launchpad icon and navigate to M Installer. You can also open it via Finder in the Applications folder of your Mac. Upon first launch, sign in with your Motion VFX account login and password. If you don't have an account, you can create one by clicking Create Account. Your login and password are the same used to log into the Motion VFX website for purchases. Click Sign In to review the license agreement and accept to continue. While signing in, M Installer will start to synchronize. This will keep all your purchases and templates up to date. The interface of M Installer offers several ways to review and find your items. You can view all of your items or search by templates, plugins, or compositing elements. Additionally, you can sort by ascending or descending date of purchase, as well as several other parameters. Having trouble finding what you're looking for, but remember the name? Use the search box to find it. To install a template, navigate to the one you want and click the Install button. You can open your template in Apple Motion by clicking the Open in Apple Motion button. Once clicked, you'll be presented with different items included with the template, along with which frame rate you wish to open it with. By default, 24 frames per second is recommended. To change the frame rate, select the drop-down arrow and choose the frame rate to fit your needs. Click Run to open your project in Apple Motion. To use your template in Final Cut Pro, no additional setup is required. Navigate to your Titles and Generators tab in Final Cut Pro. Templates are installed in a folder named Motion VFX, and MO2 templates are installed in a folder named MO2 Expansions. To find and verify a path of your installed templates, select your template and right-click it. Select Reveal in Finder. To install a plugin with M Installer, click the Plugins tab in the menu and choose a plugin you wish to install. Once installed, your plugin will automatically be licensed to the machine you are using. In the menu, you can review your licenses, the date of installation, and the machines they are registered to. In situations where you are moving to a new machine, M Installer makes it easy to reset licenses per machine. To activate or reactivate a license, click the Activate button. M Installer makes it easy to work with your licenses, so you can spend less time hunting down serial numbers and more time creating. Motion VFX plugins can be found in Final Cut Pro and Motion in folders beginning with M. In this example, you can see MO2 installed. Since compositing elements are neither plugins or templates, they will be downloaded as a collection onto your machine. To re-download, remove, or reveal your compositing elements in Finder, click the stack icon. Once in Finder, unzip your download to review your items. Periodically, M Installer will provide you with notifications when downloads or installations of products are complete. Other times, these notifications will be about new, exciting templates or plugins or compositing elements. In cases of any trouble, before contacting the support team, Please go to the M Installer Settings tab and try using the troubleshooting tools. You can find them by clicking on the gear icon in M Installer. In the Settings menu, you can adjust the default frame rate of motion projects and change the default download directory of items. In the Systems category, you can find the troubleshooting tools. Disk Permissions Use this when you can't install a product. This tool repairs the access to the folders and the files. Clicking this item will require the username and password for your Mac. Fix Fonts Clicking this will resolve font duplicates and other font-related problems. Plugins Integrity Clicking this verifies the correctness of the files necessary to install the plugin. M Installer Preferences 
Click this to solve problems with the mInstaller app, like freezes or crashes.